All right, what is going on, everyone? Thank you all so much for stopping by the Card Dojo. My name is Sean, and this is my journey into modern day card collecting. Well, guys, it is Friday, and as you know, we like to do battles and new product reviews. Today, we are doing a combination of both, although this is not really new product anymore. For me, it is because I haven't been able to find any. Uh, today's episode is sponsored by Bracket Fancy Sports Cards, who provided us with these two Donruss Hanger Packs. So let me just go ahead and get them out of their cellophane. Now, I will do a giveaway in uh, with this, and let me just actually grab it. Hold on. All right, guys, I actually had guests walk in as I was recording, so I had a pause, and I am now prepared with the giveaway options, guys. I would have liked to give out some Donruss in the theme, but I don't have any Donruss fat packs, so I'm going to have to give you a score 2019 fat pack. Go over to the video that is in my description. It will be from Bracket Fantasy Sports Cards. Uh, give them a sub, a like, and a comment. Include the word dojo in the comments so I can find you. And uh, one winner will be guaranteed this pack. Now, at the time of this recording, he is hovering just under 400 subs. So, if we can get him up to 450, I will also give a second winner this Garner Minshew rookie card and this Kenyon Drake uh, Threads mem card. If, guys, you can get them all the way up to 475 subs, we will give you uh, a Joe Burrow rookie and a Will Greer auto, and that is going to be numbered somewhere, there it is, to 40. So. Again, one more time, go over to his channel, give him a sub, drop a like, and a comment, uh, something including the word dojo so I can find you. Uh, this score pack will be guaranteed. If we get him up to 450, we give him this. And if we can get up to 475, you guys can get that. And there will be three winners. So go ahead and support people, support each other, and we can uh, keep this community uh, moving. Sorry, my little out of breath. I was running around. So, guys, on to the battle. Today, we are doing a battle between two hanger packs of Donruss 2020. In this corner, we have the Target exclusive. Where's my sword? Uh, in this corner, we have... Where is my sword? I don't know. In this corner, we have the, the Walmart exclusive hanger pack. And uh, I found my sword. It's over here. It goes right back on the stand. Okay, yeah, I'm all taking up a little time. I'm a little winded, I'm running around all of a sudden. All right, so let's open up these cello packs. And once again, guys, I will be announcing <laughs> that this rip will be my next week fantasy lineup as well because I'm running low on cards and I gotta make the best out of what I can do. So these two packs will also be my fantasy rip league uh, for next week. I'll make a lineup from these cards as well as this battle. So I'm gonna put these so they're just barely off camera so that you can't see the spoilers. And we will do a 50 card battle, a 50 card duel snap reactions. 2020 Donruss, here we go. All right, Jelani Tayai against Mark Ingram. We're gonna go with Mark Ingram. We have, oh, don't make me flip around. Uh, Kenyon Drake against Mohamed Sanu for the Rutgers crew. I'm going to go with Mohamed Sanu, who is no longer with the Patriots. I believe he's on the, the Niners. All right, Matt Stafford against Jared Stidham. We're going to go with Matt Stafford on that one. We have a Roquan Smith against a Joey Bosa. We're going to go Joey Bosa. We have a legend coming up. We have uh, Sean Taylor against uh, Steve Atwater. I'm gonna go with, um, hmm, we're gonna go with Sean. Because his name's Sean. I think they're both legends. All right, Ryan Kerrigan against a Melvin Gordon II. I'm gonna go with, um, well, you know what? This guy got in a little trouble, didn't he? We're gonna go with uh, the Washington football team player. Because we don't like people who get in trouble. All right, uh, Kevin Byard against Michael Gallup. 31 against 13, a little reversal of numbers. We're gonna go with Michael Gallup. Joe Namath against Dak Prescott. I'm not a Cowboys fan, although I don't wish injury upon anybody, even if they are a bitter rival. 
Uh, but with that said, uh, I don't like the Jets either. So, um, to wish him luck, we're actually going to give a win to a Cowboy. How about that, guys? How about that? Uh, Jack Youngblood against Odell Beckham Jr. Um, we're going to go with Youngblood. Odell, you can take a seat. No offense. Jared Goff, always showing up, never invite. Hold on. I just don't understand. I tell you constantly, constantly, you are not invited. Okay, now that we took care of that, uh, we're going to give Mike Evans the win. All right, on to the next card. Uh, Hunter Renfro against Jacob Hollister. We're going to go with uh, Hunter. We have Josh, Jason Witten, I'm sorry, against Chris Carson. We're going to go with, um, hmm. I'm going to go with Chris Carson. That's a tough decision. We have Leonard Fournette against Taysom Hill. We'll, we'll give the love to Leonard Fournette. We have a Teddy Bridgewater against Raheem Mostert. I have high hopes for Teddy. We're going to go with Teddy. The Giants PC, we have Darius Slayton against his, uh, his housemate in the MetLife Stadium, Sam Darnold. We're going with the Giants PC. We have Callis Campbell against an Aaron Donald. I think we're going to have to go with Aaron Donald. All right, we have a Blake Martinez for the New York Giants PC, despite being in a Green Bay Packers uniform against Max Crosby for the Giants PC. We will give it to this one. So far, it looks like Target's taking a little advantage. We have Mark Ingram against Corey Littleton. I'm going to have to go with uh, Mark Ingram. He struggles on the, the Ravens because, you know, Lamar Jackson is the premier ball carrier. And look at that helmet. It just looks very Robocop-ish. Strange. Okay. Anyway, Mohamed Sanu for the Rutgers crew against DJ Shark. We're going to give it to Mohamed Sanu uh, once again. Pull them both packs. Jared Stidham again on this side against DJ Moore. We're going to go with DJ Moore. We have a Joey Bosa against a Jack Boyle. I think I'll have to go with the Bosa for the Bosa Bros. Steve Atwater against Tremaine Edwards. We're going to go with, um, we're going to give it to Atwater. Pulling a, a bunch of duplicates in these, but that's okay. Uh, Melvin Gordon the second once again against a Darius Leonard. We're going to go with Darius Leonard because he does not drive drunk. Uh, Michael Gallup on this side again against Young Ho Koo. And this is a Young Ho Koo rookie card despite the fact that this is not his rookie year. Uh, we pulled a bunch of coups uh, Monday. So that's fine. Again, Dak Prescott coming up against Carlos Hyde. Again, we'll go with Dak. We'll give the Cowboy twice the love. Uh, Odell Beckham Jr. against Matt Ryan. These names are starting to pop up a lot on each side. Uh, Mike Evans against a Jahali, whatever his last Tavai. Mike Evans also beat Jared Goff. We have a Jacob Hollister against a Kenyon Drake. We'll go with Kenyon Drake. Now we're into the parallels, guys, so we can see the difference in parallels between the Target and the Walmart. You would think that the Target would have the red ones because their color is red, but we have Michael Vick in the green which matches quite nicely against Kenny Galladay, Kenny G. Uh, I think I'm going to have to go with uh, Kenny G in this case. We are all about redeeming yourself and making up for past mistakes. But uh, Kenny G. Uh, wait, hold on. <laughs> I got a little confused because we have Adam Thielen against, once again, Kenny G. Uh, we're going to give it to Kenny G. And we're going to take a little second to pull up that last card that he won. So once again, guys, one of these is the photo variation, and it would be this one here on the left uh, in his other uniform. We have both variations of Kenny G in the red press proof. That's interesting. We'll put them both up there like that. <clears throat> Excuse me. Fix my stacks a little bit, and we're moving on to a Jason Huntley against a Anthony Miller. Uh, this one right here is a rookie card, so we're going to give them the win. I'll stand one up because we don't have anything representing the target side. Now we're on to the... Um, this one has the Dominators for Ryan Tannehill uh, from the Titans. And we have a Mitch Trubisky, not Mahomes, in the red press proof parallel. I think I will go with the Dominators and uh, Tannehill. I'll put him right there. All right, we have a C.D. Lamb, the rookies, against a Jonathan Taylor, the rookies. That's a pretty good battle. That's a pretty good matchup. I think I'm going to go with C.D. Lamb... Again, I'm giving Cowboys a lot of love. I don't know why. What's going on? But they, uh, they are they are a pretty good offense this year. And uh, despite not liking them as, you know, a secondary Giants fan, CeeDee Lamb's been having a pretty good year. All right, now we have a DJ Moore. Dominators against a Zach Martin. Uh, Dallas Cowboys action all pros. 
Uh, yeah, we've been giving the Dallas Cowboys too much love, so therefore we're going with the Dominators, DJ Moore. You have a little bit of a gold situation showing up. Elite Series for J.J. Watt against his Steeler buddy, Juju. Mick Schuster. Smith Schuster. <laughs> Dominators, this is a tough decision. I think because he just stalks us and he haunts us, we're going to give the win to Juju. And he's going to cover up one of these Kenny, Kenny G's. All right, power formulas for uh, Bradley Chubb against Elite Series rookie for Michael Pittman Jr. I'm stepping on my camera. I'm sorry. Uh, this is a tough decision. I think I'm going to go with um, the potential that this guy has and the cool lightning background in his in his card. We'll give him the win. Okay, now we are on to um, Legend Series for Ed Edger and James. Old uh, legend, legendary running back from the Colts. Against an elite series for Carry On Johnson of the Lions. Double lightning strike action with these cards. Very cool looking cards. I like the inserts and in, in, uh, the parallels and everything like, like that in Donruss. Uh, I'm gonna have to go with. Uh, I'm gonna have to go with. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Edron James. Sorry, took too long on that one. Okay, we have a the champ is here for a Damian Williams against a Jonathan Taylor Colts rookie, uh, Elite Series rookie. So yeah, for the Chiefs PC, we're definitely gonna go along with the champ is here and we're gonna cover up the Cowboy. He got his 15 seconds of fame and we're gonna move on. Uh, Derrick Henry over here on the left side with the target is, what is this, a road to the Super Bowl when they beat the Baltimore Ravens. And then we have a retro series for Julius Peppers on the Panthers. I think I'll go with Derrick Henry in this case. Now we have a legend, Legends of the Fall for uh, Charles Haley against Michael Thomas of the Saints. Uh, a lot of Cowboys showing up, so I'm going to go ahead and give this one to Michael Thomas. Let me just give you a nice little view of that. And here we go. We have a CJ Henderson of the uh, Jaguars, a canvas rated rookie. But he's taking on a Damian Wilson of the uh, Kansas City Chiefs. The champ is here. Once again, you guys know, I've mentioned it before, I'm trying to collect all of the Chiefs, uh, the champs are here. And we have both of the Damians showing up. So we're giving the win over to the Chiefs, over to the Target pack. I mean, so, I'm sorry, the Walmart pack. All right, Tommy Stevens, the rookie, against Henry Ruggs the third, Rookie Gridiron Kings. I like these and the artwork, it kind of like, you know, makes it look like it's a painting and this is a canvas texture. Uh, we don't like the Raiders, but this is a nice looking card, so we're going to give them the win. Okay, on to some rookies now, guys, on to some rookies. We got Grant Delpit against Xavier McKinney. Uh, I don't like that he's in his, you know, his combine outfit here, just kind of looking like, you know, with his dual hair colors and everything, that's kind of a strange card, but I am a Giants fan, so I will have to give him the win over Grant Delpit. Taking a little pause, taking a little deep breath. All right, we have Julian o Okwara against Logan Wilson. Again, um, I'm sorry, Alexa or Google just scared the crap out of me, because I thought someone just randomly popped into their room. Uh, Julian Okwara, because he is in his Notre Dame uniform, I like Notre Dame, I'm giving them the win. Alright, we have a uh, Levon Chasen against a Kenneth Murray. I'm pretty much just going to pick anyone that's not in a combine. I'd rather see them in their college uniforms, honestly, than the, the combine. We would much rather prefer seeing them in their NFL uniforms, but you know, it's just not happening. All right, we have Ben Roethlisberger against the rated rookie for Anthony McFarland Jr. Uh, <laughs> freaking out as usual. We're going to give the win to Anthony McFarland Jr. That was fight. a Steeler on Steeler battle. Right. We're coming down to the final final cards of this battle. Travis Kelsey against Juju Smith-Schuster. We're going to go with Travis Kelsey for the Chiefs PC. All right, we have a Zach Ertz against a Tyron Matthew. The Honey Badger, the landlord, is going to take the win the rent is in this too situation. We are big fans of the Chiefs, obviously, so any Chief will automatically get the win. Lamar Jackson against a Jason Peters. I'm going to have to say that Lamb Jack is a slight advantage over the Eagle. And the final cards, guys. The final cards in this battle. Kenny Clark against a Tom Brady. Tampa. Brady. In his Bucks uniform, 
gets the win. All right, guys, so I will count up one side of the card's action. We have 50 cards, which means that the over under will be 25 cards. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. Therefore, in my opinion, the winner of this battle was Target. So now you guys can all let me know who you believe the winner was. Maybe you guys prefer the Walmart side. Either way, I'm not a fan of Target or Walmart because I just can't find cards in those stores. So um, let me just pause and do a quick little recap and a rip for you. Okay, first thing I forgot, guys. Hold on, hold on. Very important, guys. Here you go. Kid report code. There you go. Okay. Uh, the randomly inserted prize today, guys, will be the Kenny Galladay, Kenny G, press proof red, and also the Kenny G, uh, Kenny Galladay, press proof red. Both variations will be the prize today. Uh, as you know, we pick a random episode, and from that random episode, Skynet picks a random comment. And if your name pops up up there somewhere, and you want those two cards, drop a comment. All right. On to the quick post-game show, guys. This was a tough battle. Um, didn't pull many of my uh, rookies that I was looking for, but that's okay. We did get a, uh, a cool rookie, uh, Michael Pittman Jr., Elite Series rookie. We got a uh, Henry Ruggs in the Gridiron Rookie Kings, Anthony McFarlane rated rookie, CJ Henderson rated rookie canvas, Jonathan Taylor, uh, the rookies, Jonathan Taylor, Elite Series rookies, C.D. Lamb, the rookies, uh, Mohamed Sanu for the Rutgers crew, for the Rutgers, uh, Rutgers PC, and then for the Giants PC, we got Blake Martinez. We got the uh, Darius Slayton, uh, Xavier McKinney rookie card. For the Chiefs, we got Travis Kelsey. We got Tyron Matthew, the Honey Badger, the Honey Badger, the Landlord. And we did manage to pull two of the champs are here, uh, both Damians, uh, w Williams and Wilson for the Chiefs PC. So guys, don't forget, guaranteed, if you go over there, someone will win this pack. If you go over to Bracket Fancy Sports Cards, uh, channel give them a like a sub and comment uh, if we reach the one goal I offer that we will give also these two cards away to a second winner and if we reach the goal of 450 subs we will give away this Joe Burrow and this Will Greer card as well to a third and final winner guys this will be also seen again in my Wednesday video where I'll set my lineup I'll be using these cards because I'm struggling to find cards so I'm recycling sorry uh, I just got to do it. So as always, guys, thank you for stopping by and take care.